Welcome back. King Charles could be set to forgive Prince Harry for sharing royal secrets, but the same may not be said for Prince William, an expert has said. Royal biographer Robert Jobson said that a reunion could be very difficult for William, who was largely a target of his brother in his tell-all memoir, Spare, back in January. In his explosive read, Harry gave an insight into an argument that exploded between the two brothers about Meghan Markle. Harry recalled the argument, stating that William saw a red mist and physically attacked him. He claimed that the future king wanted me to hit him back, but I chose not to. During the confrontation at his London home in 2019, Harry claimed that William had referred to Meghan as difficult and rude, much to Harry's dislike. Speaking on the latest The Royal Beat, Mr. Jobson said, I do see that conversations with the king may happen eventually because a father will forgive most things and he will love them equally. But with regards to the brothers, I think it's going to be very difficult. Harry is due to travel to London next week to attend the Wellchild Awards on September 7. He will then fly to Germany to begin the Invictus Games on September 9, leaving many wondering if Harry will travel to see his father and brother while he is on the continent. Also on the show, the experts discussed Harry's new documentary series, Heart of Invictus, and how the king may have portrayed it. Despite some criticism, royal editor Katie Nichol told the royal beat that she thought it was moving. Mr. Jobson said that the king will absolutely be proud of all that Harry has achieved with the Invictus Games, including the documentary series. Despite this, the expert added that he believes the king must be thinking it is a waste, as he would have liked him, to have stayed in an organization like the army or the armed forces. Mr. Jobson added, I just think that if he'd been supported in that way, he would be doing so many things for the royal family now that he would have probably enjoyed. He hates the idea that he is not Captain General of the Royal Marines, and he hates the fact that he's lost all these positions. If he'd been in the royal family and not gone down this path, I think he'd have been hugely beneficial to the country, and he could have done even more. Thanks for listening.